Good morning, sun lovers. Welcome to the Enjoyment Channel. Let's connect with one of our reporters. Thank you, Ali. Let's explore how we can spend a few days in the Tatra Mountains in the Podhale region. Podhale is a unique southern area of Poland where you can fulfill your expectations related to travel or recreation in every aspect. Today, I'd like to share with you a few amazing ideas to make the most of your time in this part of mountains. For outdoor enthusiasts, Zakopan is a paradise during the winter months. Strap on your skis or snowboard and hit the slopes of Kasprowy Wiesz or Gubałówka, where you can carve through fresh powder against the backdrop of breathtaking mountain vistas. Alternatively, enjoy winter activities at Białka Tatrzanska or Jurgov Ski Station, where you can also go on a thrilling cross-country ski or snowmobile trip along exciting trails or feel the joy of sledding down the slopes. If you want to try skiing or if it's your first day of white chill out, it's good to start at the Kanioka slope. There is also something for you if you prefer a much quieter way of relaxation. Unleash your imagination by creating ice sculptures or relax on a sun lounger, basking in the sun's rays reflected off the snow. This ski station is suitable for every skill level. You can begin skiing under the guidance of qualified instructors, taking your first steps or refining previously acquired skills. To access the mountaintop, you can use single seat drag lifts or lifts with two, three or four to six seater heated chairs. Before riding, remember to warm up to prepare your body for the exertion ahead. Via drag lift number 12, there is a connection with other lifts, making the whole area of Białka one of the best regions for skiing and snowboarding. Winter sports enthusiasts can try their hand at 17 kilometers of ski slopes and use 15 ski lifts.
Whatever activity you undertake, remember that the most important thing is to have fun. The next place I visited in winter is Djurgol Ski Resort. The station itself is located by the main road, 2.5 kilometers south of the village center, just before the Slovak border. are situated on the northwestern slopes of Gorkal Vyach, 1045 meters above sea level. Here, a total of 4.5 kilometers of routes have been marked out, varying in terms of difficulty, slope, and length. Every visitor to the resort will find something for themselves. There is one of the most difficult black and red routes in Podhale, designed for experienced and skilled skiers or snowboarders. Less advanced skiers may use the green route. Additionally, there are ski lifts for kids. In total, there are seven artificially snowed, illuminated and groomed downhill routes for skiers. <laughs>
Today, I'd like to show you more of ski resort Kotelnika Białczanska. We'll start by taking lift number nine to admire the amazing views and enjoy some winter activities. Good 
Broken hearts don't lie An empty page, a story to write I'm in love, you're divine And it's all in our signs We're going away Get your back, check the tag Decision is made Lock your door, need no more It's already paid Cancel your mail for a while It's a journey few days of adventure, unwind and relax in one of Podhale's many thermal spas, where you can soak in rejuvenating hot springs while enjoying panoramic views of the snow-capped peaks. There are at least seven places worth visiting in the Podhale region. The first place in Poland's rankings is Thermal Baths Bania in Białka. Now, I'd like to introduce you to another top-ranking thermal bath, Czochalowski Termi is the newest and largest thermal park in the Podhale region. Located in the village of Czochalow, it offers pool areas, sauna facilities and restaurants. It is recommended for children and families. Here, you can find something for everyone, from quiet and relaxing zones to lively and energetic water parties.
After relaxed time in Spa, you can try more advanced riding places. Starting from the heart of Kotelnica, which may have its origins from the word cauldron, you can use lift number three or four. On the left side, you can try on the obstacle course track and stay there using short lift number five and enjoy the ski jumps placed along the route.
and of course, have fun. <laughs> This evening, we are spending our time in the centre of tradition and culture, where you can admire not only funny gadgets, but also wonderfully beautiful handicrafts. Here, you can find every kind of your favourite shapes to place over your desk or bed. As night falls, indulge in a cosy dinner at a traditional Highland restaurant, savouring hearty dishes like ossipek, smoked cheese, grilled meats and aromatic mulled wine. Like cheese? Here you can find sheep cheese, cow cheese, or goat cheese in white, yellow, or orange color, depending on the degree of smoking. 
your taste will be enhanced with varieties such as brinza or buns in salty, fried or smoked varieties with additions of cranberries, black cumin, chamomile or wild garlic. The quaint architecture of Zacopane's buildings, adorned with snow, creates a picturesque and enchanting atmosphere reminiscent of a winter fairy tale. As you see during the winter season, the streets of Zacopane are decorated with festive lights, ornaments and traditional Polish decorations, adding to the magical ambience. Despite the weather, the city remained lively with locals and tourists bustling about, enjoying winter activities shopping for traditional crafts and indulging in delicious Polish cuisine. The streets are lined with cosy cafes and restaurants offering warm beverages, hearty meals and traditional Polish delicacies, inviting visitors to take a break from the cold and immerse themselves in the welcoming ambience.
Whether you're seeking adrenaline-fueled thrills, cultural immersion, or simply a serene escape into nature, a trip to Podolet promises an unforgettable winter getaway filled with adventure, beauty, and warmth.